Hello everyone, uh, today I will walk you through the calculation of compounded annual growth rate or in other words Kager uh, and how to do this on Excel. So let's assume you have a set of data like this here. Uh, I just have a ready set of data here. So I have years on the left and the row data assume is dollar, a number, anything, doesn't matter. So I have the years 2011 through 2016 on the left and I have raw data that is starting from 100,000 going all the way to 213,000 and just note that these numbers are going not in the same growth rate every year so as you can see with your eyes the first year it just moves up by 25,000 but the second year here the second year it just moves up by 17,000 so they are in no certain uh, growth uh, scheme so let's see the growth rates the actual growth rates that I calculated here so as you can see from the year 2011 to 2012 the growth rate was 25 percent and from 2012 to 2013 the growth rate was 13.6 percent so every year we have a different growth rate, but how do we know the average growth rate that will make us go from 2011 to 2016 and that is called Kager. So let's calculate that at the bottom here. Just already have the formula typed in. So the formula for Kager is in plain English in parentheses we take the final number divided by first number final number being 213,000 of the series final number of the series and you divide it by the first number of the series which is 100,000 in parentheses to the power of you see this sign here the to the power of sign in parentheses again 1 divided by data points minus 1. What does this mean? 1 divided by data points 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, minus 1, 5. So 1 divided by 5, let's close the parentheses, and minus 1. So let's see how it works in the formula. So C10, which is the last number, divided by C5, which is the first number, to the power of 1 divided by 5. Since we have 6 data points here, we divide the number by 5 and in parentheses and minus 1. And the calculation gives us 16.3%. So that means on average annually the growth was 16.3%. And let's make the calculations so that uh, we reach from 100,000 to 213,000 by growing at the steady rate of 16.3%. So I have it here. Let me show you how it works. So again, we start with 100,000 and I grow the number by 16.3% every year for the next five years. And as you can see, the yearly numbers are different because here the growth was uh, just random but here the growth is steady and as you can see the numbers are different but at the end you reach the exact same number of 213,000 so that is your Kager right here so that's your five-year compounded annual growth rate which is 16.3 percent in this data series thank you